the new seven dwarf specialty cone right here we are so it's skipper canteen i got it right for once in my life Welcome to a new vlog. We are currently in Haynes City, um, which is about 35 minutes from where we're staying. Um, we asked on our Florida Orlando group on Facebook, go check it out if you're not part, it's a really good group, uh, where to go for breakfast. And a lot of people, well, a couple of people recommended- Two, two people said it. <laughs> this place, Egg City 50s Diner in um, Haynes City. So here we are. So Jules um, recommended this as well. Yeah, so thanks guys for recommending this place. We wanted somewhere new. Shit, we're gonna blame you. We always like to try new things. So this is completely new to us, never heard of it. Um, they do obviously lots of eggs. I don't like eggs. You don't like eggs? A bit screwed then, aren't you? Um, it's a 50s diner and it looks very busy. So uh, see what this is all about. Wow, it's like a proper 50s diner. <laughs> So we'll get a seat and then we'll get some eggs. Right, they actually did, shut up. They actually did seat us down the other end, but it's absolutely rammed with people. So we still like to be cautious. So we have to be moved to this table here, which is near the door. Oh, for God's sake, get the menu open then. Why don't you do it as like a little slideshow, a little flip chart. Here we have Egg City, 50s diner. Yeah. Oh, it's that place. Right, I'm gonna hand the camera to Lee because he likes doing this. Right, so there we go. Excellent, excellent breakfast. You'll have to just pause the camera, it's not in focusing properly. You'll have to pause the camera when you see Hey guys, how are you? I'm thank you. Good, what are you drinking? Um, can I get a coffee with cream, please? Right, we just ordered uh, coffee, so Nick cut the camera off, so here's the breakfast uh, menu. Excellent breakfast. Don't know what I'm going to have. Stabbing. I am hungry now. It's not just eggs though, it's pancakes as well. It's not just breakfast as well, yeah. um, it's got lovely meat. French toast and waffles. And oh, they do lunches. All oh, right, they do all sorts of stuff, man. So, normal lunches. I'll put a picture of these uh, menus on our Florida uh, Facebook group. Can I just say now that I already know what Lee's going to order? It's going to be some white eggs sick with fruit. Well, yep. I'm not even sure they do that here. I'm sure they will. I do like to get the um, egg whites, but... Um, Can anybody predict what I'm going to order? French toast. They look nice creamers. How many are you going to put in? Three. Three for now. <laughs> you get a massive bowl full of them. Yeah. Like, mm, these mega are the ones bowl. years ago we once came and we um, sat in Ponderosa and we watched a lady literally drinking Drink them all. Often? Three for me. We're just laughing because we're just... We're kind of looking around and the clientele ages around. 80 and um, we've just I've just said on discord and Lee's not seen it yet I've just said on discord that, that uh, it's like it's like being on the set of He's Cocoon right there, and um, Lee just said the same to me and I just said go and look on discord and that's not I'm not you know criticizing that well Cocoon was filmed in Florida so it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna, be, it's gonna be like this probably a lot of people might not even know what Cocoon is because it's a really old film now oh I, I liked it when um, when he takes his top off in that pool and she gives him a uh, special when I'm liking my whatever. Duties, this is the kind of place that I would love to come. <laughs> You'll not come to something like this. You'll be going to like the mermaid in Marley. It's turned up and I was just about to chuck in and forgot to vlog it. Yours don't look like your usual jaunt. Oh, thank you. Look, well, I can eat that English muffin. Mm. What we call a muffin is not what a... What, uh, a well, that's not an English muffin. An English muffin is, is like a pikelet. That's hash browns as well in America. Uh, well, it's what's it called here? No, well, I thought, no hash browns. I asked for hash. Browns. Hash, isn't it? No, not a hash brown. Hash brown. Oh, well, whatever. Butter, well. Is that? No, yeah, I don't like whipped butter. It's like it's like cream. 
So, um, oh my god, this smells amazing. It's half of a Mr. Kipling's pie with loads of French toast. I'm gonna tuck into this and I'll let you know when I finish what it tastes like. Right, we've eaten and the check is on its way. I would definitely recommend coming here. It's very good portion sizes, very clean, very tasty. The staff are excellent and um, reasonably priced as well. Oh, I haven't got a bill yet, but it looks well, like it's right? Yeah, cool, very good. Quick update on the check. So for all that, it was $19.22. Bargain. Egg City, there we go. It's, uh, it's obviously a very popular place with locals. Um, not a very touristy place, but I would definitely go back in there. That was just perfect portion sizes and very tasty. We could have shared these. Yeah, it? the service was brilliant as well. So uh, the guy that the guy that we thought was the owner says that he gets asked the question whether he's the owner all the time because he's right. He, he just acts as he the owner. Just wants <laughs> the, the <laughs> staff around and he's like, he doesn't he doesn't he doesn't hold back about swearing either, does he? No, but funny. He's done it in like it's more like a theme and yeah. a funny thing rather than a. Back you know to the I mean? car now, back to the car. Right, we're off to Typhoon Lagoon. Right, we're just gonna head for a quick chill at uh, Typhoon Lagoon. Blue Lagoon, what are you gonna say? <laughs> no, I'm gonna say Blizzard Beach. Typhoon Lagoon, just for an hour. We have a very busy day planned today. We are going to Magic Kingdom. Hopefully getting a few rides. We're meeting our friends Vera and Michael there. We have a reservation at Skipper's Canteen for our early evening dinner. No idea what the food is, I haven't even looked it up. We just kind of booked it and we're gonna experience something new. And then, if we're not too knackered tonight, we're meeting Lisa and Aid and uh, another friend of ours called Danny, who's on his pl plane right now on his way to Orlando. Um, so we'll see, we might even stay for the fireworks. That'll be a very long day in Magic Kingdom. the car and our friends are there. Hi! <laughs> what a coincidence. <laughs> oh, Lewis has got a, uh, a, balloon. a balloon, bless him. <laughs> Look at your balloon! <laughs> Here we are, Typhoon Lagoon for a chill. Wash your hands often and cover your mouth and nose when coughing or sneezing. <laughs> the waves coming. Nick's having a paddle with Louie, who's not too keen on the sound of the wave coming. <laughs> That's as far as he'll go. Bye, Louis. Bye. 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 Oh, waves coming. Oh, I don't like him, bless him. <laughs> Somebody's surfing there. I wonder if that's on the menu. Mr. Nutkins. No, he's off. Hello, come here. Here, here. Love just an hour's chilly, don't we? It's just so calming and relaxing. Take the edge off the rush. Yeah. Even well, if you just do it for an hour, do you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Friday we're hoping to have quite a considerable amount of time at Volcano Bay. Getting the water we're finally. We're from a hangover on the City Walk from Thursday night. Love their uh, Lazy River. It's the best Lazy River is Volcano Bay. And it's really heated. Yeah. Up. Right, we're following Disney Transport. That's going to Coronado Springs though. We're off to Magic Kingdom to meet our friends. Maybe have a snack, maybe go on a ride, and then we've got a meal at Skipper's Cantina. Snack? You want a snack? No, I, well, I meant a drink actually, I'm a bit thirsty. Right, we're in. Crowd levels. Oh, the Christmas tree's gone, yeah. The crowd levels don't look too bad at all here. Um, his friend Vera's in though, and she said it's quite busy at lines. Maybe they've all gone for lunch. Maybe, hopefully. So uh, we'll see what we can do. Just gonna have a mooch. We need to get some merch today for some of our friends. 
and um, we've got our Skipper's Cantina. What? Was it? Was it this Magic Kingdom? No, no, no. I know what you're going to say. It's there. Yeah, so but it's where did we see? Was it California? California was Walt's apartment. Yeah. I don't think we've ever looked in it. I've went to look in California. Right, we're coming for a for a mooch. I think we may have been in here at least once. I wonder what all them are. Are they all the uh, like prizes for the horses and things? I oh, know it's all the fire fire department um, medallions, med medals, whatever. Dallas. Oh, it looks like it's all the fire, de fire, apart fire departments from all over the country. That's quite interesting. For your souvenir coin, you can now pay with um, your card or Visa. Google Pay and stuff like that. Don't miss a trick, do they? Let's have a quick look then. Oh, look at the old-fashioned telephone. Very Downton Abbey. Main Street Fire Department. Right, let's get down Main Street. Just coming for a photo pass, we've not got one yet, I don't think, in front of the um, castle. There's only one people, one person waiting. Oh, it's our turn. Right, we've had our uh, photo pass done. Check out our uh, social medias, I'll put some on there, Instagram, yeah. or our Facebook Orlando group. Don't look too bad at the minute. Oh, there's a, I can yeah. see a parade coming down, I can see Tinkerbell. I can't hear any noise. No. Uh, it's amazing how you can go 100 yards and all of a sudden the music just, you can nip. Changes. Well, we knew that when we went on the Keys to the Kingdom, so yeah. she explained that it's designed, that the speakers are directional. Yeah. So you have to walk in front of them to hear. So at any minute now, they're just going to turn on full blast. It's just Tinkerbell, nobody else. Just waiting for another parade. I was watching this umbrella maker. She is uh, putting all the patterns on the uh, umbrellas. I can see Moana, I think, and Peter Pan. Gaston? Yeah. God, he's got his break down, hasn't he? Mary Poppins. Oh, yeah. Right, we're going on the Liberty Bell. Just gonna, yeah. Uh, just made it. Vera's here, Michael's here, and uh, here we go. do something we've never done before the country bear jamboree show looking forward to it nick which is was which is where the bears were the other day when we came with down yeah. laura we've never done it we've always just walked straight past could do with an ice cream or something though before we go in what's the history on the bears i've it's no idea scary animatronics. scary animatronics there we go vera's just uh, done that for me here we are country bear jamboree vera's just pressing some coins oh yeah i can see it doing it so you get all eight. Oh, spits them out at you. <laughs> You're not kidding. <laughs> all eight for five dollars. Do you collect them, Vera? Are they for yes, you? I do. She does now. We've actually been in here before. When we did the um, Halloween, Mickey's not so scary in Halloween. One of the treat buckets yeah, was, was in, in here, here and we came down at the front and we filled those bags, didn't we? I think that's the only time we've ever been in here. Yeah. 
Yeah. I half expect one of the Muppets to come out the curtain and start do, 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 laughing. Do, 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 do. What do they call the two Muppets? Do, 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 do. Um, and I don't know. What's that? The Muppet, the old men on oh, the Muppet. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's get on with the show. Now, both be patient. Yeah, we ain't going anywhere anyhow. We're kind of hung up here. <laughs> I'm not liking the look of those clouds up there. Nick said it wasn't going to rain today, so I haven't brought ponchos. If that rained now, you'd literally get wet for a second. Well, yeah. We're just heading round to Storybrook Treats to get one of the new Seven Dwarves. Storybrook? What, well, Storybrook Treats? You're thinking of uh, once upon a yeah. time. Yeah, to uh, try one of the new Seven Dwarves cones. Right, here we are, Storybrook Treats. So, oh, there we go. This is the new Seven Dwarves Speciality Cone. So I think they're doing like one a month or one a week or something. Uh, the Seven Dwarves. I think it's dopey at the minute. So we shall see. Right, change of plan. There was a big queue for the Seven Dwarves. That's cone. not why we changed his mind. And we are eating very soon, so we don't want to fill ourselves. We might try one That's later. That's why we changed his mind. They were massive. <laughs> they were massive. We, uh, stuff as, they do look very nice. That might we're try eating in 20 minutes. So yeah. we wouldn't have even eaten it before we were eating again. So we're heading not down. That ever stops us. Well, no. We're heading down to the uh, canteen. Uh, Skipper's Canteen now. Is it Canteen or Cantina? We'll see when we get there. Michael tells me that that is Club 33 in Magic Kingdom. Not sure how you get in. Maybe down there. That door there, maybe. Somewhere we'll probably never see. Right, here we are. So it's Skipper Canteen. I got it right for once in my life. Right, we're heading in. Our table here. Right, we're in and we have the menu. So I'll just show you quickly. The entrees. It's funny how they do with chicken. Trace chocolate chicken, chicken because it is. Yeah. Like Peking Thai noodles, that sounds good. Um, cocktails there. Vera's excited for those, I think. Me too, this is what I'm waiting for. I might try that. I almost ate the rotten chairs outside, they were that hungry. Adventureland Colada. Dole whipped pineapple blended with cream of coconut and passion fruit. That sounds nice. Um, so I need some non alcoholic, but that does sound nice. Fam Falls Family Falafel. And then your wines and I think things. There's a lot more on the online menu than there is here. Yeah, some more speciality cocktails and, and um, beers and stuff there. Like right, appetizers have turned up. We well, need to tell me what they are. What, what's that one? This is falafel. That's uh, falafel. Falafels this is with this. hummus, shrimp, and fried rice. And what's this one? This is. Uh, I can't remember what that one was. Uh, I'm sure it tastes nice. Did she take away the, the, away one, the menu? Yeah. It was chikakas or something yeah. like that. Chikakas. We're going to order something it's in the warehouse. Corn cakes with pork on top. Oh, black pulled pork. Yeah. Right, we're going to tuck into these and try them. Go on, you I'm try, try falafel Lee. Right. Shove it in, you're not cutting it in half. Nice. I like falafel. Right, the food is here. We have um, pork. That looks amazing. That bok choy, isn't it? Um, that's the noodles with chicken. That's tiny noodles. Short, Short rib. rib. And Vera's cutting into a steak there, and the guys there have a steak, and we're going to share. Oh, this looks that's good that. food. Wow. Is that short rib? What is that? Is that the short rib? Yeah. So again, classic theming in here. Every attention has been given to detail. Everything's discreet. Like there, there's a little speaker that looks that kind of event like its surroundings. The um, the room, the fake balcony is on my left, which I'm going to show you in a second. It looks like you could just sit up there. And there's the other room through there, which is a lot different. It's a lot brighter. And yeah, I can see it through there. Room, they have different rooms, but this is like the main dining room. Up there, I mean, obviously, those doors are not full-size doors. 
So it's probably that false yeah. perspective. Ask me what our, mate, our favorite meal was. Vera, what was your favorite? What was your favorite food? It's the short rib. The oh, short, short rib. rib was the best. Mine was all of them. I Mine can't really the decide. Pot. Vera wasn't keen on the steak, was you? No. Vera likes them blue. I like it. You Very like it? Rich. You like it mooing? Yes. Yeah. There's a little slap of the cheek and then go on. <laughs> it's ready. Golden hour. Sun's just about to uh, go down soon, and it's just shining on the castle there. It proper shines, doesn't it? Yeah. The gold. The gold yeah, is beautiful. The lights are just. Oh, shut up! You'll be eating in an hour. I will not. Lights are just coming on. Temperature's dropping. Temperature is dropping, it's now. getting nippy, so we're gonna head out, go get some warmer clothes, and maybe head back later to meet Lisa. I wanna go in one of these. Yeah, just taking in the uh, ambiance of the Magic Kingdom at uh, Main Street. The last time we saw fireworks in a uh, a Disney Magic Kingdom style park was in Paris, wasn't it, when we had the uh, little kids pushing in? No, we, we saw it here. No, not with Lisa. No, not with Lisa, no. Oh, you mean with Lisa, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, Nick, challenge. Who are all these princesses? No white. Right, hang on, we'll start on this side. Wait, Who's hey, the first one? I'll let me cherry pick first. Go on then. Uh, so, well, everybody knows Snow White. Um, Meredith. Which one? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not even you knew that. Jasmine next to her, I think. I can't see for the Yeah, it is Jasmine, yeah. Um, Belle next to her. Uh, then yeah, it's Tangled, Belle. whatever she's called from Tangled. Yeah. Rapunzel. Uh, Rapunzel. This one here with the ginger hair. What's this one called? Is that uh, Ariel? Yes, Ariel. Uh, Snow White. Yeah. Uh, the Princess and the Frog. Sleeping Beauty. Aurora. Yeah. Cinderella in the middle. Wait a minute, I did four. I'm not. That's not bad. Who's that in the red? Um, I don't know. She's on the kids' show. She's uh, on I don't, I don't, she's on a kid's I don't know. Well, I thought I've done well, to be honest. You're not mad at it, actually. I'm not a Disney princess, I'm sorry. That's I've never... Diana in the green. Oh, from Princess and the Frog? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, okay. I There's called it the Princess and the Pea the other day. Cindy. Yeah, Cinderella. Cindy yeah. Well, that's five. I've done yeah, well Yeah, not there. bad, actually. I've never seen them all like that, lined up. No, I think you... Uh, and Jasmine. Next yeah, Jasmine, yeah. Uh, Merida. Oh, right, we're coming for the monorail. Well, we are. We will be in a minute. We're going to head back to the Bazaars, have a chill. And then, uh, monorail, monorail. have a chill, and then possibly go out back out tonight, back here again, for the fireworks when we meet Lisa. Whether that happens or not is another thing. Scar one four. Scar, wait, what a number? Scar four one four. Scar four one four. I was going to take a photo, but I thought I'd remember it. <laughs> yeah, we haven't got it yet. We haven't found the car yet. If, if you get this right, it'll be the first time you've ever remembered the parking. Four one four, my backside. Yeah. Four one four. Wait a minute. Four one four. Four one four. We're at least seven, seven over. Four one seven. Maybe. We're there. Four one nine. I would say four one nine. What's this one? 416, 417, got it wrong. Right, we're back at the Bazaars. We've been resting for about 30 minutes and we've got to go back out again now to the fireworks show. We're meeting Lisa there. She's already in the park. Lee's faffing about upstairs, doing I'm whatever. Shirt on because it's bleeding cold. She's a bit cold tonight, actually. I'm just going to put my hoodie on. Um, 
And then we're going to head back to Magic Kingdom again, which kind of seems pointless since we just left it like half an hour ago. But we just needed some time off his feet and somewhere to chill. Unfortunately, Magic Kingdom doesn't have anywhere like that. I mean, we could have sat in a cafe and had a drink, but we would have been around people and it was just nice, to get, just nice to get away from people and just have like half an hour just chilling on his, on his own. Lee's been titivating on the laptop and I've been titivating upstairs. So we're going to go back Talking to... Talking titivating. No, my, getting a bit big. My tits are rest, right, massive tits now. So as soon as we get back, we are going on a crash diet. Right, we're heading into the park. So it's about half past seven, half an hour till the fireworks. Somebody asked us on our Instagram, when um, do the toll booths here at the gate let you in for free? So it's half past seven in the and there was nobody there. Could be later when you try, I don't know, but every we're time- We're not 100% we've, sure. We've, we obviously can, we, we can park free, so it's, it's irrelevant, yeah. but obviously for people that do pay for parking. Seven o'clock onwards a point, maybe, I don't know. Well, that's just guesswork, it's half yeah. seven now. Animal Kingdom seemed to do it a lot earlier. Yeah. But um, half seven, and the fireworks are at eight, so who knows? You'll have to, just, get, you have to just chance yeah. it. The monorail, or the boat across, fingers crossed, we'll get over there to meet Lisa and watch the fireworks. You best put your foot down. Come on, Come on Grandma Jane. seems to be the best we can do tonight because it's rammed everywhere. There are a nice spot behind these umbrellas so I'll be able to see the fireworks going up there. going to do you can't see face. Nick's face but we're going to do small world because it's only 10 minutes wait time and we've not done it yet this trip here we go it's a small world 10 minute wait time I just said did he want tambourine or drums and he didn't answer I think he did what up? Hello, sorry, I'm just trying to ask you. You just asked me what my favourite country is and I just said the last one. But you don't know what the last one is. No, we can't remember. But you're not hard for then. <laughs>
we've just got off, I was going to say Snow White, but obviously we don't, I've been on Snow White. So on Small World, one of the things that Christian Jen once told us about years ago, and we've never seen it in action, was right at the end, there's a little bit of an Easter egg. When you're coming off in the country where it says goodbye, Al Zayn and all the, uh, in the languages, there's a TV screen, and apparently it picks up your name from your magic band, and it's just done it for Lisa, and it popped up on the screen saying goodbye Lisa, didn't it? Peter Pan is only 30 minute wait time. It could be five minutes. That's the lowest I've seen it all holiday. Right, Nick's on the hunt for some ice cream. It's shut, Nick. The circus is shut. <laughs> we went to Storybrook Treat and that was closed too. Oh well. Do you want to go on Dumbo instead? Short? How can it be shut? Should we go on Dumbo? No, wait a minute. That's the souvenirs. I don't want a souvenir. I want. It's closed for we... snacks. Is that where we went last time? That's where we went last time when we got a slushy. Shall we do Dumbo over here? No. Why not? I want a drink or some ice cream of some kind. No, I'm going to get it from here. So this is something you don't see very often. The garage that services all the cars, the guy there is refilling them with fuel, checking them over and then putting them back out in the little parking lot there, ready to put them back on the track. And as we walk down, you can literally see behind this blue wall here, there's like dozens and dozens of cars. You can just see through a gap there, look you, where they're all um, stored inside. I'd probably say there's about 50 to 100 cars behind there. Closed, I'm afraid, it's closed. That's the third one. <laughs> the smoothies at the Merchant of Venice is closed, that's closed. Oh well, at least that's moving. People move it for the first time. That'll probably be closed by the time we get on it. Right, we're all gonna go on buzz. It's a 15 minute standby. See if I can beat Nick this time. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Right, Lee's plan to win this is for me to vlog and him control the car. I vlogged the other time. Well, as long as I'm sitting where I sat the other day, this is not gonna help you. We'll see, Chitty. I'm trying to fix my gun. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. There must be another one. It's rubbish this game. I don't like it. You cheated. Tonight's wait times are great. We have, oh, I thought it said 20 minutes, but it's 30 minutes for Space Mountain. So, uh, can't say no to that. Maybe we'll have a Joffrey's instead. Huh? There's no way that this is 30 minutes. We've literally gone through most of it already. We'll find out what happens when we get to the end of the year. Right, so it said 30 minutes. We haven't seen anybody and we're actually going on the ride now. So it's literally a zero wait time. In fact, there's nobody here at all. Nobody here and nobody queuing. Oh God, I don't want this ride. Every time. <sighs> I would have to convince there that we're gonna get a dead chopped off. Oh my god. <sighs> right, that was fun. So just to point out <laughs> I convinced that somebody were gonna die on that. That was 30 minutes standby queue it said outside. There wasn't even 30 minutes. There wasn't in there. even a single person who was who were waiting for somebody to get in. Yeah. So uh, another time when Disney are faking standby times. Right, we're heading out of the park. We're a bit tired now. 
Although it is still a great time to do loads of rides because uh, there's no wait times hardly at all. But uh, we're heading home because we've got an, a, a late night tomorrow night at Cabana Bay and Universal City Walk. I'll be up past 10 o'clock tomorrow night. Ooh. Nick's still after a snack. He's off to look to see if this... Uh, oh, it is open. <laughs> I like the look of that. Mickey caramel apple with M&M's. That looks nice. Yeah, that looks real nice. Oh my god, I want some of that. All the uh, apples look nice. Hey, they're not bad price. 5 49 for a massive cookie. That's a rip-off. For an M&M stick. Um, oh, I don't know what I want. It's getting summer. <laughs> This one looks nice. What's that? M&M's and... Let's have a look. 50th caramel apple with M&M candies. I could quite easily eat one of them, I've got to say. Well, I'll just share Nick's instead. Are we sharing? Let's have a look. What you got? Why have you got it in a bag? Well, I presume they're doing it from like to keep it fresh maybe I don't know it's not gonna stay in the bag though just hold that Ugh. god it's like an industrial bag <laughs> doing an Instagram get a blurry background Nick don't forget now go in outside and get the castle in the background as well <laughs> what I ain't got my phone. It's, I forgot my phone. Oh, there we go. That's perfect. Perfect. Wait a minute. I'll put flash on. Check out our Instagram at the Lodge Guys. There we go. Ooh. just got off the monorail. It's been a long day. My feet are actually almost not functioning at the moment because they I'm hurt tired, that much. I'm tired. I'm tired, but I'm dying. I'm gagging for a drink. Get to watch my birthday. We might have a root beer when we get back. Mm. So we are uh, going to finish the vlog now. All he is. Thanks for watching today, guys. Hit the like button, click the notification bell, drop us a comment below. We read all comments. You're in a rush. <laughs> and battery is flashing. Oh, yeah, it's battery is flashing. Hit That'll stress him out. Button if you are new around Slow. here, tomorrow Slow. we're going to Universal for our first ever Universal hotel stay. And our, we're going to have a night on City Walk, which Can't we've never them. done. You better find them. Bye for now.